Hi, my name is Leroy. I'm South Indian. I'm from Kerala. And you know my family they follow the traditions of Kerala very religiously. Because when we play poker at home, we don't use poker chips. We use banana chips. <laughs> Nobody knows how much money is there in the pot. I see your five and raise a ten. <laughs> right. Uh, in Kerala, we have a very popular snack called the vada. You know, it's the circular hota, hole hota. But I don't know why in Bombay they call it medu vada. Why is the name of the snack a question? Why are you confusing me? I went up to this guy in the canteen the other day and I asked him, "Ki bhaiya, ek plate vada dena." He's like, "Sir, medu vada." I'm like, "Ha, to fir aur kaun dega?" <laughs> Oh God. <laughs> I'm finally shooting this man. <laughs> oh, but uh, you know, I also went to a bad school. Uh, the problem was because they did not teach English properly over there. It was an English medium school which used to teach us medium English. <laughs> so you know, we had to rely on movies which came out at that time to learn English, and those movies they were made. With the aim of improving our vocabulary only, movies like Dhun the Fog, <laughs> Dhoka the Fraud, <laughs> Jal the Trap. <laughs> I was learning so much through them. In the exam, I asked a question: pucha, Why does the visibility in Delhi reduce during winter? I wrote because of Dhun the Fog. <laughs> <laughs> that movie got a B grade, but I got an A grade. <laughs> In fact, I'm talking to my friends also like this one. Like, "Hey, brother, you didn't come to school today." He's like, "Hi, brother, I got a cold. The fever was bad." This friend of mine, uh, his name is Aditya, and Aditya is such a common name that all Adityas are literally one in a million. <laughs> There are at least seven thousand five hundred of them. I just counted. So, <laughs> but you know, he was a very weird guy back in school. बिकॉज ही वॉज बेसिकली दैट काइंड ऑफ अ गाय जो अपने ही नाखून से गला स्क्रैच करके बोलता था कि ये हिकी है करके वेरी वियर्ड गाय ही यूज टू थिंक दैट टेरा बाइट एंड मेगा बाइट आर बेसिकली लव बाइट नेम्ड आफ्टर पीपल दे आर नॉट यूनिट्स ऑफ मेमरी फॉर हिम ही इज ग्रोन अप बट हिज हैबिट्स आर स्टिल द सेम यू नो बिकॉज ही हैज अ नोकिया फोन बट वेन ही रिप्लाइज टू ई मेल्स ही पुट्स इज सिग्नेचर इज बेस्ट रिगार्ड आदित्य और उसके नीचे सेंट फ्रॉम माई आई फोन ही टाइप्स इट आउट But uh, he is a very cocky guy back in school, very cocky guy. Because uh, I know you guys must have encountered some instance, right? When the bell used to ring, but the teacher would keep on teaching, jata hi nahi tha. So he would sit right below the teacher's nose, or na fir bar bar piche mudke watch dekh raha. The teacher got really annoyed. He said, "Alte, ek kam karo. Pion ko bolke na ye ghadi aage lagwa lo, taaki tumhe piche na mudna pade." This guy is like, "Sir, fir aapko kaise pata chalega? Jaane ka time ho gaya hai karke." <laughs> I caught up with him some days ago, and uh, apparently he has uh, made it big as a banker. So I was really interested to know his journey. So I asked him, "Okay, dude, what got you inspired into banking?" He said, like, "Bro, I saw the Wolf of Wall Street. <laughs> after that, all I wanted to do was banking." I'm like, "If after watching the Wolf of Wall Street, all you wanted to do was banking, then there's something wrong with you." <laughs> I mean, for sure, there were some ups and downs and forward-backward moments, but none of them were in the stock market. Is all that I'm saying in Wolf of <laughs> Wolf of Wall Street? Put the sex in Sensex is what I'm saying. <laughs> Great movie, yar. Wolf of Wall Street is amazing. I just don't know. I mean, mutual fund investments they tell us to invest in, right? Mutual fund investments are not subject to market risk. They're subject to narcotic risk. Why do you think? <laughs> why do you think market crashes keep on happening from time to time? दोपहर में डेढ़ बजे रिलायंस में इन्वेस्ट करते हैं अनिल अंबानी वाले गॉड इट इट्स मैन हिज ड्रीम रिसेंटली केम ट्रू ही गॉड अ चांस टू गो टू दी एक्चुअल वॉल स्ट्रीट इन न्यूयॉर्क एंड दे आर आउट ऑन वॉल स्ट्रीट दे हैव दीज अमेजिंग गोल्ड प्लेटेड स्टैच्यूज ऑफ अ बुल एंड बेयर outside on the street and after reaching there he did the most indian thing possible 
Oh, she's already expected. Exactly, ma'am. He posted a picture of himself on Facebook while grabbing the bull's testicles. <laughs> Why do we as Indians we lose our shit around landmarks? 2021 है अभी भी लोग जाके ताज महल को ये पकड़ रहे हैं. उनका compliment है. There is another set of people who's holding the Taj Mahal like this also. उनको लगता है ये वाले गिरा देंगे तो उन लोग catch करेंगे. Why are we losing our shit around landmarks, yar? I am pretty sure if we bend and नीचे वो बोल के देखेंगे ना वो balls पे पक्का एक heart shape structure के अंदर Ramesh loves Pooja भी लिखा हुआ रहेगा घर के. He moved jobs also recently, Aditya. He after banking he went to a cold drink manufacturing company called Mirinda. ठीक है, I visited him one day at office and he was showing me के Mirinda बनता कैसे है, bottle में डलता है and how it's packed off etc. और ये मुझे दिखा रहा था and he felt very thirsty. And the water bottle was too far away. तो उसने वहीं में से लाइन में से पी लिया और वापस रख दिया और वो बोतल पैक होके it went off. Fun fact, guys, Mirinda is a PepsiCo product, just like Lay's. So the next time you tear that Lay's packet and find that there are less chips inside it, <laughs> you know who has eaten it. <laughs> But you know, finally Pepsi got to know about this habit of his, and they fired him. And last I heard, he was working at Zomato. So, I mean, finally, it was a match made in heaven. But I was telling you about this bad school, right? It was bad also because of my teachers, because I had a chemistry teacher, organic chemistry teacher. So he was paid more than the other teachers because his subject ke naam mein organic aata tha. So, but you know, my chemistry teacher, he was an alcoholic. And it took us a lot of time to put it together because हम लोगों का भी पता ही नहीं चल रहा है। Finally ना ये राज सबके सामने आया जब मैंने उनसे एक बार question पूछा कि sir इस experiment में acid कितना डालना है? Dilute डालना है या concentrated डालना है? And he replied large neat. Finally the secret was out in the open. But he was a guy who would never compromise on the quality of work. He had literally set the bar very high. No. We would always wonder कि सर के standards हाई हैं या फिर सर खुद great guy the other fact which was bad in the school is my class teacher for those of you who don't know class teacher is basically that guy who promotes his own subject above everybody else's and I had the misfortune because my class teacher was Sanskrit teacher शास्त्री सर you know शास्त्री सर he was the Sanskrit teacher because he was Brahmin so he had done his masters in Casteism. <laughs> That's what it was. And uh, because he was like a very orthodox Brahmin, he would not even sit on the chair that was provided for the teachers, you know. He used to get his own stool. If you guys have read history textbooks, Brahmins always used to sit on the stool and uh, divide people into castes. So that was the world's first casting couch. <laughs> uh, he was an orthodox Brahmin, as I said. And uh, orthodox as in he was completely bald and he had that ponytail. Uh, so guys, just a thought for you. Have you guys ever done a toss? What are the results of a toss? Heads or tails, right? It's exactly the front and back of a Brahmin's head, right? <laughs> Good. A great guy. But uh, he also did not know any English. Given a Sanskrit teacher, I wouldn't expect him to, but uh, yeah, all of you have masks, so you only will pronounce properly. Uh, dude, tell me now. C-H-A-L-L-E-N-G. How will you pronounce that? Challenge. Challenge, right? Yeah, yeah, you only. <laughs> <laughs> Challenge, right? And he used to pronounce it as Chalenge. <laughs> Chalenge, accept it. <laughs> there are basically two things for which a class teacher is paid salary. One is to distribute report cards. Now he would do that job well, but the problem was he would announce ranks in Sanskrit. Like Pratham, Dvitiya, Tritiya, Chutiya, like that, he would announce the ranks. Just kidding, just kidding, no. He would announce the ranks properly, but the problem was he would start taking names of festivals in between. Ankita Pratham, Suresh Dvitiya, Akshay Tritiya, Ganesh Chaturthi, Nag Panchmi. Navratri list out kar diya beech mein. God. The second problem, second thing that a class teacher has to do is to take attendance. The problem is he would screw up the names of kids in the class here. There was this girl in my class whose name was Chloe. 
C H L O E Chloe, and he used to call her Chole. <laughs> Screwed up. Yes, uh, I, at this point of time, I can compare actually myself to Virat Kohli. Looking at the absurdity of it, now I'll tell you right now. <laughs> See, in my childhood, I was taught by an alcoholic and a shastri. <laughs> God, really. But you know, I told about these instances uh, of bad teaching in my uh, to my parents, and then they switched schools. They moved me to a school called Delhi Public School. Great school, yeah, Delhi Public School. They had, they were very unique because they not only had a sports team, they had a cheerleading team. <laughs> that cheerleading team had an amazing jingle also. It goes like Alpha, Beta, Gamma, Theta, DPS, Jita, DPS, Jita. <laughs> Some of those guys, they have made it big as lyricists in Bollywood. You know, their latest work is Pilade Divane Mai Hoon Jiski. I'm a bad girl, I like whiskey. <laughs> When these guys get bored, they go and comment on Surya Vansham's YouTube page. <laughs> Neem ka patta kadwa hai, baap aur beta judwa hai, like that. <laughs> Everybody is thinking there's now two words that now rhyme with kadwa. <laughs> <laughs> Great school, yeah, Delhi Public School. Uh, the other thing was, Delhi Public School had a lot of celebrity kids. But not like A-list celebrity kids. B-list celebrity kids, not like Taimur and all. B list celebrity kids is like MDH wale wo dada ji na unke pote ka pota <laughs> and that guy was very sanskari yaar matlab usme uske sanskar uske masale ki tarah koot koot ke bhare hue the matlab uske body mein so sanskari once in science class the teacher asked him a question hey what's the formula of potential energy and he replied asli energy such such mgh 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 yeah the masala is MDH. Energy is MGH. What is this? I am recording this. <laughs> Great, yeah. But they had like a very evolved method of teaching all of us, you know. Like there was those essay, those letter writing kind of questions at that point. Just me kabi full nimil sakta. Tha. Ten marks a question arti milega. By default. And no justification. I got to get to it. I asked them. Why did they cut it? No, son. Just cut it. At that point, I was thinking. And then later on in my future, I have realized. Ke, why are we complaining that our educational system is not progressive? Because that was them teaching us about income tax. One time the time came. The paper was a little dirty. So I cut the other number. Why? Swatch Bharat says. <laughs> Really horrible. But you know, now education has evolved a lot, especially in recent times. Because I recently heard that a prestigious Indian examination asked a question of what is Virat Kohli's daughter's name? They gave three options also. Vanshika, Vamika, Virushka. There is a hashtag but no one has to You know, I remember but when Anushka Sharma delivered, a lot of newspapers reported this as front page news. And at that time, everybody was sharing the Zakir Khan meme, you know. I will write it in UPSC ke exam. Mein na a jai. And UPSC was like, Hey bitch, come on. <laughs> oh God. <laughs> Times of India is not fun. My wife has a job there. But <laughs> it's a great newspaper, Times of India. Because... Uh, I think at one point of time, when all these questions, they will form part of our history only. Now BJP is cutting the history from the rate, so I think that the syllabus will be reduced. So this all will be part of history and then we will be able to tell future generations how the history textbooks evolved over a period of time, right? Ancient India, Medieval India, Modern India, Times of India. <laughs> that will be the evolution. Times of India is a great newspaper. It's the only newspaper where page 3 goes on for 18 pages. <laughs> I really don't understand how does that newspaper work. But it's a great newspaper. I read it uh, generally when I'm on a call with nature. <laughs> yeah, generally I read the Economic Times but uh, problem is economy slow now. I don't have paper. I told the paper, I said, I'm going to do something, you know. 
economy is slowing down as i mentioned and uh, there's no greater proof of it than uh, patanjali's revenue going down for the first time in 3 years uh, you know patanjali patanjali great company patanjali started out with the aim of becoming the number one company in the fmcg market एंड मार्केट में नंबर वन बनने के लिए उन्होंने हर प्रोडक्ट में गाय का नंबर वन मिला दिया बट आई लाइक रीडिंग न्यूज पेपर आई थिंक दे आर गेटिंग ऑब्सोलीट डे बाई डे बट आई लाइक दम इन द पेपर फॉर्मैट देर इज दिस वन न्यूज पेपर दैट आई रियली एडमायर विच इज कॉल्ड मुंबई मिरर <laughs> Everybody knows where I'm getting it, but wait till I get to it. <laughs> Mumbai Mirror is a great newspaper. I read it for this column called uh, "Ask the Sexpert," <laughs> because uh, Doctor Vatsa is a great guy. Ninety-two, uh, he was ninety-two years old when I started reading it, and uh, and you know he's like the best friend of be it a nineteen-year-old or a seventy-year-old. He can answer your questions. मतलब आफ्टर आई रेड हिम फॉर टू इयर्स आई कुड नाउ गेस हिज आंसर्स तो अभी जो होता है ना अब मैं क्वेश्चन पढ़ता हूँ और फिर ना आंसर ऐसे छुपा देता हूँ पीपल आर आस्किंग ऑल सॉर्ट्स ऑफ वियर्ड क्वेश्चन दिस वन गर्ल हु आस्ट हाई आई स्लेप्ट विथ माई कजन एंड आई एंजॉय डिट अ लॉट कुड दिस कॉज एनी कॉम्प्लिकेशन टू विच माई रिप्लाई वॉज नथिंग सेक्शुअली बट इन योर फैमिली मे बी Uh, it would have been much better if uh, when he was alive he would have started a podcast on sunday mornings and called it tan ki baat <laughs> which would have been way more useful but one sad thing guys in 2020 dr watsa passed away he passed away you know and but the column is still continuing so he's like captain america ki kisi ko to ab ye kaam karna hi hai kar ke aage but uh, here's the thing he passed away at the age of 96 which is sort of like a tribute to him <laughs> Because his age is the number sixty nine doing a sixty nine. All right, guys. Thanks. You guys have a lovely.